So I'm here with my brother, my first fan brother, as a matter of fact, Mr. Terrence Baldwin. You from uh, Montgomery, right? Well, born, you live in Montgomery. Born and raised. You born and raised in Montgomery. On the playground is where I spent most of my really? days. Really? Mm -hmm. I did not know that. Did you go to Alabama State mm -hmm. University too? Yeah, when I was there, I was chilling out, maxing all, relaxing all, cooling all, shooting some b-ball outside of the school hall. All right. So the reason why he's able to flow like he does is because <laughs> he's also a a a crooner. He's a, a, a wonderful performer and uh, he is a member, founding member of Sold Out. And um, Terrence, let's go back. So, Grown and Greek County in its inception um, actually did a, 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 a night. Mm -hmm. It was at 1st and 23rd. Right. And you performed. Right. And who would have thought that now we'd be kind of full circle sitting down talking wow. about right. Grown and Greek? Right. And we appreciate it, you know. Y'all have always shown love. Yeah. To the groove, and I remember that night was a groove. Yeah, it was a groove. Twas a groove. It was. It was definitely a groove. Let's talk a little bit about your your singing career mm -hmm. thus far. When did us? How long has Sold Out been a group? Sold Out started back in two thousand and two, maybe mm -hmm. in Montgomery, Alabama. Uh, at a spot called Igor's. I know Montgomery oh, man, people. I Where Igor? Igor? Yeah, yeah, Blackwell, Igor. rest in peace. And uh, we started out. We just that was like a rehearsal, and it just kept growing, kept growing, and next thing you know, we've been we've been going ever since. Mm -hmm. So it's you and um, Angela. Yeah, Angela. It used to be uh, Tara Lucas, Andronette okay. McQueen. I've had three or four female singers, mm -hmm. and they're all doing their own thing, you know. There, but it's Angela now. And Angela's a Delta. Yeah, she's a Delta DST. Okay. He, although I'm still checking, I sent the letter to National. She's, I'm joking. She's, <laughs> Angela, he calling you out. <laughs> I think she plays in Miles. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. So tell us, a, you know, a little bit about what you guys, um, what kind of music you guys like to perform. I mean, I've seen you, mm -hmm. and y'all rock it. But what kind of music um, can people expect? You know, if they wanted to book you guys. Soul, R and B, funk, groove. Blues, we try to give you whatever you need. We even do a little hip hop, you feel me? <laughs> <laughs> and you play instruments too. Yes, I play piano. You know, if you don't get the full band, we break down to a duet, uh, piano and vocals, uh, you know, uh, whatever you need. Now, I remember you performing. Uh, one time it was you and, and Angela, mm -hmm. and the reviews that we got from mm -hmm. that performance, literally, I, we, I don't know if we ever told you, but they like enjoyed y'all so much, like, wow. we gotta have them back, we gotta have them back. And I'd never seen, it was just the two of you before, yeah. I've seen the band, so that's pretty dope to be yeah. able to, you know, just tear up a night with, yeah. with two of you being on the piano and yeah. her singing, so that's Kind of cool. acoustic vibe. Yeah, yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, definitely. Now speaking of, you know, your involvement as a musician, Musician and as a singer, you have a an organization. Yes, yes. Me, um, Meow Academy and Meow Cares. That's my uh, music school where kids come and learn piano, guitar, voice, and drums. And it's also a nonprofit where we teach uh, young students with autism, music. You know how they can become better learners in society, mm -hmm. better citizens. We also uh, provide STEAM Academy, so it's making my music career become full circle. Mm -hmm. um, You're sought after, in other yeah, words. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just won some awards for Meow, too. Yeah, well, um... I've been trying to keep up. Yeah, no. yeah, um... Insights <laughs> uh, Marketing out of Atlanta, they, they uh, acknowledge five ASU alum and five A&M alums and mm -hmm. you know I was nervous being up there with some of those big time as Quinn Rawls, well, uh, Sister McKenzie yeah. but you know it was it's a, an honor and a pleasure. Yeah so if people want to get involved with the, the foundation and with the school how can they do that? Uh, the foundation you can donate volunteer at meowcares.org or meowacademy.net now let's let's get into um, the 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 Greek life part. Okay, of it. okay. Now take us back to the yard real quick. What number were you on your line? Okay, when I played H5A, it was quad, 
on my spring 2000 line. Okay. You still got them got them steps? What? Can you still train? What? Do you what? kick your leg up real high too? Not no more. You Not know. no more. The closer I get to 40. You know? <laughs> I heard that. So you were the quad on your line. Mm -hmm. Okay, you still Okay, you still participate with, with the brothers on I the yard? I do, I do, man. We cut up for Thanksgiving. Okay. Uh we just we really just got back on the yard, but you know, uh, and we're gonna stay on the yard, right? Yes. Yeah, right. <laughs> but yeah, I still participate. Okay. Not as much as I should, and for Founders Day, man. We had a brotherhood smoke at the cigar shop. Man, it had to be 60 some brothers and we that's went and right. we cut the food. Okay, that's all right. Now let's talk a little bit about, you know, of course, Greek life is important to us, but mm -hmm. for, you know, everybody out there, what's your charge to them in terms of just making the world a better place? What's your charge to your, your FIA brothers? Just remember who we are. Uh, I think we came together strong, uh, getting Doug Jones into office yeah. um, and we believe as a fraternity a voteless yeah. people is a hopeless people so shouts out to us but more than anything we're not a game we should partner with other organizations and uh, make sure it's all love and we we give back to the community and help the people well I appreciate it we're gonna be on the lookout how can everybody find you on uh, social uh, Wolfgang Baldwin on everything Instagram snapchat Facebook Wolfgang Baldwin I'll be there what where did that come from Wolfgang Man, I'm a, I know I'm a dance, but listening to Sirius FM and it was a commercial about all the famous Wolfgang, Wolfgang Puck, Wolfgang Mozart, and I came and typed on Facebook, what if I change my nickname to Wolfgang because my wife said I couldn't be go as T Nasty anymore. Oh my God! And uh, everybody said I'm I think glad. you should do it. T Nasty was the hit though, wasn't it, Russ? <laughs> well, oh, Russ can't cut. <laughs> T nasty man. T nasty. What? When? The swag was on a whole nother level when I was T nasty. Wolfgang, you know, I had to bring it down, but T nasty. I like Wolfgang. Wolfgang yeah. got some swagger. I feel you, but got some smoothness. T nasty had leather that, pants. Leather pants. You feel me? Had to fade and everything. No, nah, bro. No. Okay. No. Yeah, Wolfgang. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you. No doubt.